This is a C. Jason podcast, and I am Kristen Nowak from the University of Colorado, here with my colleague, Dr. Bernice Gittimer. We recently completed a translational study measuring vascular function and contributing mechanisms in participants with early-stage autosomal dominant polycystic kidney disease and matched healthy controls. Throughout this podcast, we will refer to autosomal dominant polycystic kidney disease as ADPKD for short. ADPKD is a systemic disease, and in addition to affecting the kidney, cardiovascular complications are common. The proteins polycystin 1 and polycystin 2 are expressed in the vascular, endothelial, and smooth muscle cells of blood vessels. Individuals with ADPKD are known to have vascular dysfunction. It's also been shown previously that individuals with ADPKD have increased oxidative stress and inflammation, but how this contributes directly to vascular dysfunction has not been well characterized. To evaluate the roles of oxidative stress and inflammation, we employed some novel methods. We measured brachial artery flow-mediated dilation, a measure of health of the vascular endothelium, under two conditions. First, we infused normal saline and measured flow-mediated dilation. And then we repeated the test following a high-dose infusion of vitamin C. We also collected endothelial cells from a peripheral vein. We found that the infusion of vitamin C improved flow-mediated dilation in individuals with ADPKD, but not in controls. This showed that vascular oxidative stress was contributing to vascular dysfunction in this population. We also found higher expression of the pro-inflammatory transcription factor, nuclear factor kappa B, in the ADPKD group, supporting increased vascular inflammation. Overall, our results provide preliminary evidence that oxidative stress and inflammation are physiological mechanisms contributing to vascular dysfunction in early-stage ADPKD. Interventions targeting these processes could potentially reduce cardiovascular risk in this population. This podcast is copyrighted by the American Society of Nephrology, all rights reserved. All content in this podcast is for informational purposes only and is not intended to be medical advice. This podcast should not be used in a medical emergency or for the diagnosis or treatment of any medical condition. Please consult your doctor or other qualified healthcare provider if you have any questions about any medical condition or before taking any drug, changing your diet, or commencing or discontinuing any course of treatment. Thank you for listening to this podcast of the American Society of Nephrology.